Okay, <clears throat> so step number one. Uh, I guess this is my fourth video now. Mm -hmm. uh, step number one, cut wire for the switch. Strip the ends. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to take these this wire this uh 24 inch wire and uh it doesn't have to be 24 inches you can make it however long you want okay we're going to take these two wires we're going to line them up with each other kind of like that and we're going to take one wire and push it back i don't know just a little bit about uh maybe a quarter inch maybe a half inch uh maybe uh six millimeters maybe a centimeter something like that uh okay so and then we're going to take the rest of it and we're going to you know twist it up i'll show you in a second when i have it twisted okay our wire is twisted up now and we've got our two ends and uh and we got our other end which is you know just a loop so we're gonna cut that loop we're gonna cut the loop you know what i just had this idea it might be better if i uh <clears throat> okay sorry i thought it'd be better if i have a uh a, a background that's like just pretty much one color okay let me aim this up a little bit here we go so uh i'm going to take uh these uh, two ends and i'm going to strip them uh about three millimeters each yes or an eighth of an inch there we go okay not very long on the other side we're going to strip uh, this one this uh, long one we're going to strip it uh, about a half inch maybe a centimeter yeah something like that uh, and we're going to cut this one a little bit shorter than that one uh, okay there we go okay we might have to adjust that later okay so this one about a about a half inch maybe and this one about three um, three millimeters or an eighth of an inch and a half inch so that's like about a centimeter basically for this one okay sorry okay so now next thing we do uh geez uh, uh i gotta uh, geez hold on Okay, now we've got our two sides with the wires. So there's uh, this side with the two uh, wires that are even with each other, and this side with the two wires, one's longer than the other. The long one we're going to leave. We're not going to solder this right now. We're going to solder that in a couple of minutes. Uh, th this one we can, uh, we can tin, and these two we can tin, so we're going to tin these three. Okay, here we go. Okay, kind of see that? Okay, here we go. I'm going to put a blob of solder on my iron first, and then I'm going to touch my soldering iron and its blob to the the wire that's exposed and then I'm going to eh, my stuff is creeping back my insulation the plastic stuff the insulation is creeping back oh we still got a little bit of a blob okay I'm gonna touch that blob to the other uh, exposed wire and then I'm going to touch my uh what should I call it uh, solder to the to the wire that's hot now okay and uh then I'm gonna put my solder blob in my uh, uh other somewhere else uh 
Okay, and that third small one. <coughs> Put a little bit of a solder blob on my soldering iron. Hold it to the wire. Once again, people, I'm really sorry that this isn't very, uh, 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 focused. There's uh, my focus isn't very good. I'm sorry about that. I wish I had a better uh, camera. I'll get a better camera in the future with a uh, zoom and all that stuff, so I can zoom in on small things. Okay, so uh, we got our wires tinned. Okay, uh, next is the switch. Hold on. Okay, this is the switch. This is step number two: solder to switch and uh, uh cop switch leads glue wires okay cut switch okay so this is the switch we're going to turn it over and we're going to grab our uh we're going to turn it over and we're going to grab our uh what should i call it our our snips and we're going to cut off all of the connections on the back And then let me let me look. Uh, let me see. Okay, how do I have it done on this other one? It's just those other two. It's just those other two connections in the corner, so we can cut off this connection on the end. Okay, there we go. And those are the only two connections that we need to have on this switch. Okay. So I'm going to put my switch up here and then I'm going to tin my leads on my switch. Clean off my clean off my soldering iron. Okay. A little bit of solder on the end of my soldering iron and touch it to the lead. Oh, it goes right on there. So the lead is uh, already tinned with a uh, something that okay so that's good that worked out great now what we're going to do is we're going to take uh, these two wires that we have there we go right there these two wires that we have and uh, they're kind of long can I zoom in anymore no that's as much as I can zoom in okay the uh, the tin part is kind of long so I'm going to cut them a little bit shorter so that they're about uh, three millimeters eighth of an inch something like that okay and I'm gonna turn my switch uh, so its butt is facing towards us and the two leads you can see the two leads up there on the top right there yeah okay so there's the two leads and I'm going to solder these two wires right there and because these wires are already tinned these wires these connections should just go ahead and solder right on well I still have a little bit of a blob of I still have a little bit of a blob of solder on my soldering iron okay that one's soldered on oh jeez okay and got the second one solder uh, touching got that one touching and then I'll solder that one right there and since they're uh, since they're tinned already, you can usually just uh, touch them to each other. It's very rare that you gotta that you gotta put any extra solder on there when they're already tinned. You can usually just touch them together and then put the soldering iron there, and then they'll heat up and melt together, and that's usually it. Okay, so we just uh, we just uh, soldered to the switch. Okay, step number three: solder battery clip on strip ends. Uh, uh, clatter, solder battery clip on uh, strip ends yes we're going to solder the battery uh, the battery wires onto this oh 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 no wait we still have to we still have to glue this thing we still have to glue this thing and you can kind of see those uh, I wish my wish my focus was better you can kind of see those two leads now that we got these leads connected to them those leads are, are now that we got these two wires connected to our two um, leads sticking out uh, they're sticking out kind of high so I'm going to I'm going to clip the tops of them 
so that it's nice and flush. There we go. You can barely see that. <laughs> nice and flush. Okay. Now I'm going to heat up my uh, my uh, I'm going to heat up my uh, glue gun, my hot glue gun, because we're going to glue these to the back of this. We're going to glue them flat like that to the back, across the back. There we go. Okay. Back in a minute.